Another emphatic victory for Emmanuel Macron that has given the French president an absolute majority in the National Assembly and the power needed to push through his reforms. But many polls have predicted an even larger number of seats for his party. It will be a very different parliament, much younger and with many more women. The Republic on the Move was only founded as a party just over a year ago, but there will still be an opposition voice. The risk was that if, if the whole National Assembly was controlled by Macron's people, uh, there would be no opposition in Parliament and opposition would express itself elsewhere, uh, that is, in the streets. National Front supporters were celebrating Marine Le Pen winning a seat for the first time. The Conservative Republican Party is set to win more than 100 seats. They've been humbled, but not humiliated like the socialists who've been reduced to a rump. Ce soir this evening concludes an electoral cycle that was certainly too long for many French people. We cannot forget the high abstention rate which hasn't been seen since 1958. It's not the overwhelming majority that some polls were predicting, but nevertheless, President Emmanuel Macron has got a strong grip on the National Assembly. He's going to need it, though, to face down the unions when it comes to reforming the labor laws. That will be his first real test. He also wants to cut more than 120,000 jobs in the public sector and reform pensions. David Chater, Al Jazeera, Paris.